let it out. I'm so sorry. Welcome back to Ivy Gelp House. Today we're going to talk about seiyus. It's a recent obsession, okay? I've just really immersed myself in the fandom at this time, right? I've always been aware of seiyus and how like they have their own fan bases because I was I, I, I was into anime. So it's kind of a given that I kind of know like the statuses of like uh, people in the seiyu industry. I think the one seiyu that I kind of followed was Takuma Terashima. I'm going to butcher all these Japanese names. Like I really don't know how uh, a few months ago me and a friend um, shout out to that friend you know who you know you know who you are kind of like uh simped over a lot of Tsubami Junichi's character he has a, an amazing voice okay and for some reason it, it escalated to um Yoshino Hiroyuki and then it, it escalated to us finding the mysterious unit Stamen which is like a kind of group for them and then uh later on we found out the Kiramune Kamiya Miyu and uh Miyu Irino it's such a great pair. Like, I don't know, they have like great chemistry. I don't know. Uh, and then I've immersed in myself more in the fandom, right? And I and I know there are some talented female seiyus. I've focused more on like the, these two groups, like Hiromune and the mysterious unit Stamen. The Stamen, if you don't know, it consists of uh, Suwebe Junichi, Yoshina Hiro Hiroyuki, Yasumura Makoto, Kishio Daisuke, uh, Suzumura Kinichi, Toruyumi Kosuke, Takahashi Kiroki. First thing, is that they're all hot. Oh my god, I found find them so attractive. Please don't please don't Google up their ages. And they hold like these um these conventions, right? And the thing is like the stomach already um disbanded a few years ago, I think in 2016, I'm not sure. But there is hope. There is hope that they will come back again. And I and the thing is, you know what, I really love the stomach because their chemistry is so amazing. Like I I uh, it's just it, you can tell that they're very, they're very comfortable with each other and like they're they're just a friend group. You know? And it, I mean it's initiated by Suwabe Junichi and Susumura Kenichi. And the thing is, um, the members didn't know didn't really know each other when they uh, first started off the uh, the group. But they got close to each other and they wow, it's amazing. They have like clips. They have like little clips from their like dvds and like all these like things that they do from their conventions not a lot of them have english subtitles right i'm sure there are foreign fans of kiramune and stamen but for some reason it's just the the clips of like you know having them having like english subtitles are not are not circulated very well so i find these clips on from their dvds and conventions uh, on Bleebly, please don't. Yeah, shh, from Bleebly, and I watched them, and I sit there. It's like, hmm, hmm. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great that I, if I understand Japanese, know what they're actually talking about? I watched them, and I kind of get the gist of what they're doing. Example, that like they're doing like the the game or something. They were like acting like cavemen. It's really weird. It, they're just so fun, and they have like such big personality that just it just you know. They just jump off each other, it's great. And they have like really fun banter, but the thing is like it's not, I can't understand it. And I know it's like hilarious. I know the banter is so cute and fun and hilarious, but I don't understand it. Uh, but but the good thing is Kira Muni, uh, the clips from Kira Muni are, with English subtitles are more circulated. I think it was Egutan subs that, that, that provided. Thank you so much. Shout out <laughs> Nalu subs. I've, I followed Nalu subs as well. Cola TV, pretty sure. And like Kira Muni, they have a they have a more structured kind of thing. Yeah, they have like those like that little hierarchy, and it's and it's kind of cute because also because your uh, Yoshino Hiroki Hiro, Hiroyuki is older than. Namikawa Daisuke, but Na Namikawa's uh, rank is higher. Well, in Karamune, which is which is fun, which is cute because because he calls because he calls him Paisen. It's like, oh, <laughs> oh. Okay, okay. Here's the thing, right? They're so they're all so old. They're all so old, and uh, there are new and upcoming seiyus like Uchida and a lot of his friends. So I'm looking forward to them. I'm looking forward to them to to you know become more famous and make a name over themselves in in the industry. Those two groups are are have, like their members are very experienced and veteran seiyus. You can, you can see like Jun Suabe Junichi is in so many animes, <laughs> Nam Namidai as well, Yotin as well. The compared to everyone in the Salmon group, I think the one who is more more notable in the theater scene, 
rather than the Seiyu scene as Yasunari Makoto. But I love him. He's my favorite from the start. Man. And then I try to find his like clips, right? His like plays and stuff because he he he's in plays. And I don't I don't understand a single thing. But as long as I can see his face, that's that's great. I know that some people are gonna come for me by like because like I'm not pronouncing their names correctly or like I don't know much of the Seiyu fandom as of now, as of now. <laughs> but yeah, I I figured I'd share this to our lovely audience. That's it for this video. Like and subscribe. <laughs>